Welcome to the first vlog of the year. So it is 2020 and this is my first time picking up the camera since I ended Vlogmas December 26th. Haven't picked up the camera since but I did miss it. Every time I went to bed I'm like I didn't end the video today that seems weird. But I am back now in my dimly lit bedroom. Still haven't fixed the lights to this place. Oh, and one of the lights is out. No wonder it's so much darker in here. So I thought I would vlog today because I'm heading out. I'm going to do a bit of shopping like I always do. I need to pick up a few things because I need to take my Christmas tree down here pretty soon. So I need to get some containers. And yeah, I'm just going to go head out today. My parents are coming with me. They wanted to come. So yeah. That is what today looks like. I'm not sure what this video is, if this is a weekly vlog, a weekend in my life vlog. It's just a vlog of me, but I know this isn't going to be just one day. I'm going to combine several days. So yeah, let's just see what my YouTube channel is going to be like in 2020. And I can't wait to take you along with me and hopefully do more videos this year. Here is my dimly lit outfit and my messy, messy bedroom. I'm gonna hopefully declutter it in the next few days. So this is just my top. It has pearls on it. Very pretty. It's from H&M. And then my bow is the same color and it has pearls too. So I went with the pink and pearl theme. I just have some acid wash jeans. And then slippers on because I haven't put on my shoes yet. I'm also using my Christmas present bag. So that is my bag of choice today. And that is my outfit. I have minimal makeup on. I should turn it around and show you. I just did my brows, put on mascara, a little bit of concealer because I'm still very dry. And yeah, that is the OOTD for today. I might throw on a jacket too because it is cold outside, but it is still bright. So that's a good sign. Did a bit of shopping in forever. Got some hair accessories again. Have to show that to you later. This? Yeah. And I have one of Hello everyone, as you can tell by the transition, it is much later on in the month now and I haven't been really vlogging too much. I haven't picked up this camera. Well, I have. I've been filming two other videos that I'm still working on, still filming for, but like actual weekly vlogging, I haven't been doing that. I mean, this is pretty much a monthly vlog now, but yeah, I am back because I have an exciting day planned. Today is different because I am getting a new laptop. I think I'm getting a new laptop. You know what? I should be positive. Put it out in the universe. I'm getting a new laptop today. So I thought that would be exciting. During Vlogmas, uh, I noticed my laptop was very, very slow and cannot handle anything anymore. And I was going to upgrade it, um, like put more uh, RAM or whatever on it. But my dad said I should just get a new laptop, start fresh. It is turning three years old this year in April on my birthday. It was my birthday gift. Uh, after I got home from my vacation, I bought that laptop and it's been with me. It's edited so many videos. Uh, it did three vlogmases so far. And yeah, I just love that laptop, but I'm kind of sad that I have to let it go. I thought I would document it because I don't think I've ever documented getting a new laptop. I, this is the third, if I do get it, and I do want it, um, this would be the third one that I've bought. Um, the other laptops that I had were always hand-me-downs, so my dad would buy a laptop and then he would not use it for a while, so he would give it to me. And then now it's the opposite. I'm gonna give him this laptop. So he's just going to buy a new battery and maybe get some RAM for it for himself because it's still a working laptop. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just slow to edit videos on. Honestly, that's the only problem. And it's running out of room. But if I take off a lot of my stuff off, off of it, then it would work fine for him. My dad's best friend is also in town. He's here in LA at the moment. So my dad's have um my dad has been having a fun time with him. So they've known each other for years 
and they just are hanging out right now and he has the cutest dog so the dog comes over his name is Sparky and I got to dog sit him the other day and I had so much fun and he just loves me and my mom he's such a cute dog I have to get him on the vlog because I love dogs so much so my dad's best friend is going to pick us up later and go with us because he's kind of like a computer expert so he volunteered to help out and to see what I should get so that's going to be exciting he's going to be here a little later so I have a little bit of time to get ready I don't know if I'm gonna do makeup today I am gonna curl my hair I washed it last night so I just grabbed my cereal bowl and this is what it looks like I got cocoa puffs they were on sale like buy one get one free or something on cereal yesterday so I decided to buy some cereal and milk it's been a while I used to be obsessed with cereal and then I get tired of it and then I don't eat it for like months and then I get obsessed with it again so I guess the cycle is starting over again fun fact about this spoon this is my spoon from the Philippines so this was always my spoon everyone knew not to use it because this was my spoon so honestly this is the first thing I packed in my suit case when I knew I was moving to LA. I grabbed my spoon, I put it in my suitcase, and I didn't get it out until I got here in LA. Hello! So I did my hair and I put a little bit of makeup. I put some concealer, some blush, mascara, did my brows. I'm gonna put a tinted lip balm later, but I made me some lunch, or technically I warmed up some lunch. So this was from I don't know last night the night before and it's just my pesto pasta and I really like it I'm going to make that all the time now or whatever because it is so good so just smelling it smells like the Philippines to me because right before I moved here to LA this is all I cook there it was like the only thing that I could make really good really fast and it wasn't a very good time of my life like I was in limbo, I didn't know what I was doing, I was very anxious about my move and everything. So it kind of brought back that memory as well when I was like putting it away last night. I smelt it. It smells amazing, but the smell just brought me back to just being so anxious. So <laughs> I don't know, I'm mixed about this food. I really love how it tastes and the smell and everything, but it just reminds me of that time in my life that I didn't know what I was going to do with myself. Uh, I was really anxious <laughs> and so like it's so conflicting to me <laughs> but I think I'm just going to push through. I'm going to make more happy memories with this smell instead of the bad ones so I'm going to eat this and you never know I might get my laptop today so that might change my outlook on the smell <laughs> and yeah my dad's best friend just got here so he is out there talking with them. I'm going to finish getting ready. I need to put my outfit. I'm going to wear an all white winter outfit I think for my blog so I might take outfit pictures today as well that's why I got a little bit ready I couldn't do too much makeup because my skin my skin my skin is still healing from being cracked and stuff so I think I shared like my new skincare routine in another vlog so I'm not gonna talk about it here but yeah this is my current makeup that looks pretty decent and is okay for my face so yeah that is what I'm wearing what I'm doing and I'll catch up with you whenever I go oh here is my outfit this sweater is from the SM department store in the Philippines I wanted to wear a white sweater today I thought I didn't have one but I do it has bell sleeves I was obsessed with these sleeves when they first became popular and it has a pretty quote on here I think it says embrace your imperfections I think that's what it says um, my white headband is from icing these high-waisted old navy skinny jeans so I have a in black I wear them all the time and then these are the white ones I think I'm losing a little bit of weight because they are becoming quite loose on me my Kate Spade bag that I got for Christmas when was this in 2018 and then I'm gonna wear some white sneakers but I'm too lazy to change so wearing slippers <laughs> so yeah that is a look at my outfit I also have a white or it's technically a cream um, teddy bear coat that's what I want 
okay so I'm gonna put that over top I have my laptop in here I'm gonna put my camera all that stuff and yeah I feel really cute and I feel like that episode of Gossip Girl where they wear all white especially with this headband I mean it's not as girly as that but I feel like that and I've never worn an all-white outfit so this is going to be fun so this is my OOTD I guess let's head on out and see if we can buy myself a laptop let's go Hello, so I'm back home as you saw that is not my laptop that I bought that was my actually my dad so he ended up getting a laptop for himself I wasn't contented and I didn't like the laptops that were there and I'm not sure if I should switch <laughs> if I should switch to a MacBook or stay with Windows so that was kind of a fail but I did get me something so we ended up going to Best Buy afterwards and I got me an iPad so I failed and didn't get me a laptop but I did get me an iPad so if you watched Vlogmas Day 18 where I shared my Christmas wish list I shared that I wanted an iPad for Christmas because my iPad, which is right in front of me here, where is it? This one right here, it is almost six years old. So it has done its time. So it's still pretty good shape. It's great and everything, but I got a new iPad, which I'm so excited about. But uh, something else bad happened to me today. So something good happened and also something bad happened. I shattered my iPhone. <laughs> I've never shattered an iPhone. I've had four iPhones. This is the fourth one and I've never shattered one. I break in the tempered on it, but I've never shattered it. So <laughs> it is smashed. I got a new tempered glass on it at Best Buy because that's where I shattered it in the parking lot. And when I heard it crack, I'm like, no. And I thought it was the tempered. And then I, I took it in. You have to pay $8 to get a temper done at Best Buy, which is so unbelievable. But here it is. And it is so cracked. I'm so sad. I've never cracked an iPhone before. Seriously, I've never cracked one. Um, my 4S, I remember it fell out of the car and I just got the temper done on it and I just went white and there was a little like crack in the screen but I took off the tempered the next time and it was just a tempered glass but this time I actually shattered my iPhone so that is so sad I'm just I hate it I hate that I shattered my iPhone <laughs> So I'm gonna look into getting a new one. Um, I don't want to really get this repaired. This is my Philippine iPhone anyways. All I do is watch Insta stories on it, use Twitter. So it's technically a small iPad. This is what this is. So <laughs> now I'm kind of gonna replace it with this. I'm going to film an unboxing here. So stay tuned for that video. I'm talking for three minutes, so I should get off and start my unboxing. And yeah, so that was my day so far. It was good and bad. So too bad. I'm really heartbroken, but um, I'm still being positive that it happened for a reason. Uh, that's why um, I cracked it because I was going to get a new iPad today. I feel like that is what the universe was trying to tell me. I'm trying to be more spiritual, more positive that way. So it was meant to be to crack my iPhone, I guess, because it wanted me to experience a new iPad. I don't know. I still have my 8, which is my US phone. I have to use this here. Um, and I think I might upgrade this next month or for my birthday. I'm not sure because I really love the iPhone X. Maybe I'll get the 11 X. Maybe I'll stick to the X. I don't know, but I'm going to stop babbling. I'm going to set up my tripod and I'm going to film my iPad unboxing. So stay tuned for that video. Hopefully I'll get it up and hopefully I get a new laptop soon to edit on. Yeah. So next tip you'll see is probably me with my dad's new laptop, not my new laptop, his. I just got done filming my unboxing of my iPad, which is so much fun. So it's right here. I'm trying to be so gentle with it after breaking. 
<laughs> my iPhone today. And then here is my old iPad. And then we actually have the computer my dad bought himself. So we're gonna unbox it here on my bed. I guess I can just show it to you when we get it out. So yeah, I'm going to change again because I wanted to wear this for the video. I'm gonna change back into my comfy light. sweater. My dad interrupted me. I turned down my wing light because it was just getting too bright in here. Also, I changed my lighting above here so it's a soft yellow. I could not find uh, a white daylight bulb for my room because it's a ceiling fan light. So I still have to use my ring light. I tested it with my dream board video and the lighting wasn't as good so definitely need to use a ring light so i just turned it down though because we don't need that much lighting to vlog do we me and my dad are gonna unbox this here on my bed and then i'll show you what it looks like i'm so excited for him that he has a new laptop <laughs> and i don't not bitter at all am i but i'm totally gonna get me a new one pretty soon we're gonna turn it on for the first time ready daddy yep three two one <gasps> there it goes oh it lights up the keyboard <laughs> there's my old one back there it looks so sad <laughs> yay oh you can see me <laughs> Happy Tuesday! So I thought I would jump on here and add some more stuff in. I'm just gonna show you what I've been up to at the moment. So the last clip you saw was me turning on the laptop and that is it. So we got it all set up and my dad kindly lent it to me. So he let me use it to edit videos on. So I've done two videos and I'm working on a third. So I've completed two and a half videos so far, which is so great. I got my iPad protected. My case is coming in the mail and I'm working on a blog post. So I'll show you my current setup here on the bed. I have my old laptop, which I'm using to write blog posts on. I have my iPhone here that is cracked beyond smithereens and it's really sad, but I think I'm going to upgrade this to the iPhone 11. I'm currently watching Scooby-Doo, What's New Scooby-Doo on my iPad. It's the first show that I'm watching on Netflix on my new iPad. That's my old one back there holding the new one up. So I'm really enjoying What's New Scooby-Doo and it's great to have on in the background while I'm doing two things at once. So yeah, I got to edit on this one and it's so much faster to edit on. And yeah, I, you just watched all that footage, but I have this laptop set up, my iPad, my laptop, my phone. This is all the setup. And yes, that is my unmade bed. I just threw my blankets that way so I can prop my iPad up. So <laughs> that is my current situation. I also got this brand new four terabyte hard drive. So I have a two terabyte that's almost full. So I needed more storage. So I have that and yeah. Those are all the screens and all the things that I'm doing at the moment. That is what I'm currently up to. Not doing too much, just being productive. So hopefully I can get this out on Friday and do my blog post for Friday. And I'll be a little bit caught up with my work. I have a lot more stuff planned. So hopefully I'll be vlogging again soon. But for now, this is the end of today's video. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye everyone!